Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be talking about Lashkara. Lashkara is an online website that sells a lot of shalwar kameezas, saris, langas, and I've been getting a lot of questions about um, my kind of experience with Lashkara, ordering plus size outfits, custom to my size, um, as well as like shipping, price ranges, anything and everything. So I thought why not make a video about it considering Eid is a little bit away. This will hopefully give you guys some advice in ordering from Lashkara and seeing if it's a website for you. So, um, P.S. This is not a sponsored video by any means. I just happen to really love Lashkara and I'm so happy that there's finally a, a website um, that that complements plus size girls and South Asian wear. So this video will be the negatives, the positives, everything that you guys want to know and my genuine, truthful, honest opinion. Remember to subscribe, like this video if you like what you see, of course, and follow me on Instagram. My handle is right here where you can see more outfit of the day pictures as well as pictures of my outfits from Lashkara. So first, let's talk about things that I've ordered. I think my first order from Lashkara was this blush pink and mint green floral outfit, which was custom made um, to my size and to little specific details that I wanted. Um, after that, I've ordered a couple saris. I've also ordered random shalwar kameezas for dawats, dawats, sorry, um, as well as like random outings. And then most recently, I customized my brother's wedding um, outfit for myself. Um, and that was heavily inspired by a look that Dress Your Face did recently um, in the last year, I guess, for one of her brides. So let's talk about these outfits in a little bit more detail so I can show you exactly a little bit more about the material and the colors and everything that I ordered. So the first one that I'll start off with, which I've had a lot of compliments on and questions about, is the one that I wore for my brother's wedding. Okay, so first let's talk about the skirt. So the skirt looks like this it is kind of like a sky blue um it came a little bit bigger than i had wanted but they did put two like strings so that you could like tie it up and make it um even tighter basically the skirt looks like this this would be kind of like the front and then it's the exact same thing in the back it does fall a little bit lower than where like my actual feet are which is awesome and then you are able to also um tie it at the top um, and then it also comes with a zipper um, just to ensure that everything stays in place um, the whole thing is made with a couple layers of tulle I would say probably about three layers of tulle is in here which is perfect because it really um, allowed for me to have that like poofy bottom which is what I wanted floral pieces go all the way uh, to the bottom so um super super beautiful outfit and now I'm gonna show you what the top looked like for this outfit so you guys are gonna die but I actually ordered two um blouses for this skirt because I really wanted to go for that like um sleeveless hatgata look um which the dress your face bride was wearing but then I kind of got a little bit nervous and then near the end I was like oh my god can you guys make me like the, the exact same blouse in long sleeve because I'm not usually like a half sleeve kind of girl so they were really really nice enough to make both for me so I will show you what both of them look like this is the top that I originally wore for my brother's wedding I ended up going with um the sleeveless look I was like you know what this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. I will probably never have the guts to do this again, or maybe this will let me have more guts, which I think it did. Um, so it's like, why not? So basically it is the same sort of material, except it's like a blush pink, light pink, maybe even coral type of color. I would say coral. It's very similar to NARS orgasm blush. But anyway, um, it looks like this. It comes with a zipper. On the side the zipper is a very tight very secure and then it comes with a clasp at the end to make sure that the zip stays in um one thing that i really really loved about the blouse that they totally listened to which was super important for me was the straps right here um although they are see-through and still made of like some similar tool fabric they made them thick and my bra straps are thick so that really really helped because had they made this piece like a little 
teeny string my bra would have showed the whole time and so anyway this is that piece it also comes with the matching floral pieces along the two sides as well as um the tool right here um which was like my favorite part but you're able to like extend it to make it big or you can basically like clump it up again uh, to make it small uh, which is what I did so this I think was actually the hit of the outfit well I think everyone really liked the outfit but this was the part of the outfit that everyone was like oh my god this really makes you look like Princess Jasmine and I think it's because of the um the two sides here but that was the look I was going for I was really looking for that Princess Jasmine type of look so I really really loved this so the next outfit is or sorry the next piece is um this is the full sleeve um full sleeve blouse that I ordered also last minute that I actually didn't end up wearing um but I'm excited that I got this blouse because I could technically wear this with like a gold langa bottom or like some sort of tool and make this into a brand new outfit so um one other thing that I forgot to mention that I really um do love about Lashkara is that their arms are tight they're not like loose and weird and they use material that isn't thick um so it makes it look like you're like slimmer because there's less material and it's a tighter fit. It's this net material that they use for the arms and the bottom has the typical like floral print um, floral print that you see all throughout the outfit um, and then you have the same design along the neckline um, and then it's quite short. I mean it was for me because my boobs take up most of this blouse um, but no it's a really really um, good outfit and something else that i like is if you if you know a lot about like south asian clothes you'll know that when you have darts inside it really emphasizes your like the structure of your body and like i can't explain it like brings things in and brings things together so they did dart all of my outfits which was really exciting so here's a close-up of the material that was all throughout the outfit um as well as the tool lace that I really really like. Next I want to talk about the mint green and pink floral outfit which is basically the same colors as the one that I just showed you that I bought for Eid um, last year. Uh, Lashkara had posted this on their Instagram. This was my first outfit from Lashkara and it was just like I was so happy. I was so impressed. Everything about the fit to the length like the height of the outfit everything was perfect so anyway this is the outfit and one thing that I really like about it is my chest is really really big but they made this part like right under my chest really tight and then they flared it out which is like exactly what I wanted um, but basically the top is just a simple pink and I usually I do like to keep my tops simple um, because I have such a large chest I don't want to emphasize too much um, attention on those girls so um, kept it really simple we did kind of like this sort of a shape just a little bit of a gold outline nothing too crazy the arms are that same sort of like net material as the other one and then the bottom um, has like this tight there we go this like tight gold um border so this is what the top looks like now for the bottom let's flip it over a little bit um this is the bottom so same as my other lenga they use like um fabric like floral pieces um the whole thing is tulle and again you probably have like i think two layers of tulle and then you have just like a simple material underneath which is super comfortable it's like cotton and not itchy at all so it's perfect um but the height on this bad boy is amazing because it goes like down and then some so amazing outfit there um the back of the outfit i kind of ruined a little bit but no big they came with these two um tassels i broke one off unfortunately um because i was tying it too hard but they do come with that detail and then the dupatta is very similar to the actual like dress itself um it is pink with the borders so same as the hand but they um were really uh cool and they put the um floral like what are these things called 
they put this thing all throughout the dupatta. So that really kind of like enhanced the look of the ornament and it wasn't too simple, which I asked. So anyway, this is my Eid outfit. I've worn this afterwards to a wedding a couple weeks ago, um, and it is always, always, always a hit. So super happy about this outfit as well. Okay, so my next outfit, actually I have quite a few outfits, but I haven't like worn them or taken pictures with them that are Instagram worthy yet. So I won't be showing you everything, but I did want to show you my third outfit because it's a little bit different than the blush pink and the mint greens. This one wasn't actually customized by me with a picture. This one was on their exclusive website and I picked it and I said I want this in my size. So um, basically, I haven't worn this one yet either. So you'll see this one on the gram, I'm sure, very soon. I actually might wear it for Eve. It is this beautiful Anarkali or Shalwarkanis. It's white lace at the top, which really sold me. Like the whole neckline here will be white lace. So that was super exciting. And then the arms are um, kind of like a little bit past my elbows. I wish they were more three-quarter sleeves, but still really, really pretty. Very, like, a nice, good, tight fit. And then the bottom of it has, like, pearl. And then over here, the bottom of the skirt, or the bottom of the outfit here, is, like, this green, like, this emerald green color. I think that it's beautiful. The material is not net. It is not, um, I'm not good with explaining materials, but I think it's similar to silk. So different than what I would normally wear. I'm really into like the pastel colors if you haven't been able to tell. So it's going to be a little bit different but I'm super excited to wear this and I think I might wear this one for Eve. Um, the Orna as well as the jewelry their pants that it comes with are very simple and basic but the Orna is just like the simple white Orna and then the jewelry there um, is also the simple white white jewelry there so i won't show you guys um that stuff in detail because i'm sure no one really cares about that but um yeah this is my outfit that i'll probably be wearing for ease and i'm obsessed with like all of the details anyway so that basically concludes the little um showing of my outfits i only showed you guys three and that's because the rest are all going to be on instagram let's talk about pricing now Pricing for a lot of outfits that you find on Gerard Street here in Toronto are very, very expensive. Um, so lately, a lot of people, I feel, have been shopping with, like, basement aunties, uh, which is basically aunties that sell these types of suits in their basements for a much, well, relatively lower price range. So I find that ordering from Lashgara was actually even more cheaper than picking something up from these basement aunties, mainly because... Um, if you go, I think it was like over $100 at the time, shipping was free. Um, but if you buy a couple different outfits, shipping is always free. So um, all you're really paying for is the outfit. For my mint and floral uh, blush pink outfit, I paid $172, which I think is like amazing no questions asked um for my mint floral sorry that i bought that i'm not going to show on this video yet because i definitely want to use it um in the near future uh that was about 150 dollars um for my bridesmaids dresses uh for my little cousins which i'll picture right here um, we paid $130 per outfit and customized to their size like it was perfect. Um, my recent outfit um, for my brother's wedding, the mint and blush pink like floral outfit, that one was $255. Um, now that one is relatively a little bit more expensive than others, but still I think it's cheaper than what you would find on places on like Gerard Street or like a basement auntie's house for the quality that I got. And, and it was customized to my size, so it was perfect. These prices are relatively good for what you're getting in the sense that they're customized and they come in your size. Um, but make sure that you're not looking at US prices. And I think when you first join the website, you can get 10% off if you just sign up with your email address so I know that that would be super helpful for you as well if you're looking to make a purchase really soon let's talk about the actual website itself now a lot of these types of websites are very hard to navigate I really find that Lashkar is super easy and um, super easy to navigate and just like simple so if you go onto their website they have like everything based in categories such as shalwar kameezes langas saris all that sort of thing. those items come in like the sizes that are listed so you can't customize 
specifically to your body shape. Um, I think it's a little bit different for saris because obviously for the blouse piece and the petticoat you can customize, but typical like show recognizes and leggings and stuff like that you cannot. Now if you wanted to go into actually customizing something completely, you can just send them an email um, and then they will kind of you know discuss with you exactly what you're looking for, the colors, the price range, all of that sort of stuff. And then if you wanted to order something that you like on their website, um, but you want it in your size, you can head over to their exclusive line where you can customize any of those outfits that are listed in your size. So for me, my issue is always my my chest um, as well as my hips um, and so I do need to get it customized because sometimes they'll come and they'll fit but they won't go over my boobs and that is my literal life struggle. Um, so basically the exclusive line is for custom orders but you can also email them separately if you see a picture of something that you like on Instagram or Pinterest and they can definitely remake it for you. I know that obviously there's always that chance of it not coming exactly how you want it but but um, they're pretty good like I have to say they every single outfit that I've gotten for them I've been super happy with the results so. so when you're checking out so say for example I really like this mint green and blush pink anarchy with the floral that I ordered when I was checking out they let you fill out like this form and on the form it shows exactly where you need to measure and what you need to measure so for example around the bust area it'll show from here to here from your shoulders it'll show you a diagram from here to here and then you just take a measuring tape and measure yourself um, I did have Irshad help me at home because obviously who the F is going to be able to measure themselves properly like from your length and your height areas such as your chest um, but usually Lushgar will add a little bit of material on the inside so you can open it up but I think adding an inch or two is better uh, for it to arrive a little bit bigger so that you can bring it in a little bit as opposed to it being tight and having difficulty opening it but yeah so the form is super easy it goes through everything from like your shoulders to your chest to your stomach area to your hips to your height you fill in all of the measurements you hit okay and they may email you to ask you to clarify some of your measurements but pretty much it is what it is they give you what you write down and it's super easy to navigate let's talk about communication okay um communication i feel is super difficult um through email when you're talking to people in other parts of the world and trying to obviously explain what you want so uh for me i think pictures and sketches um really kind of help out the person on the other end of the computer understand exactly what i want um which is like like, awesome um, but I actually find that communication with Lashkara is pretty good um, they I've never had a moment where they don't really understand what I'm talking about um, there's always been clarity within our conversations which is super important for me because I have no patience and I can get annoyed very easily sometimes um, but no they're really really awesome in terms of communicating with you um, another really great thing is that they respond back to you within 24 hours so you're not waiting a really long time uh, for them to get back to you about an outfit or any other questions that you may have I think only once I waited like 48 hours um, like two days essentially for a response so there's been times where you know like they might take two days to respond but it wasn't really a big deal because I did have a lot of time and I did order way in advance um, so I wasn't really worried about that so another really good thing about ordering from a website such as Lashkara is that you don't get that backlash that you do from aunties when you're ordering in store um, or having to hear about your size um, because I've had stories like that like for example let me share the story with you guys so when we were first getting married, we went to this store in Toronto. Sorry, I have the windows open so you might hear some cars driving by. But we went to the store in Toronto to get um, Airshed his outfit and then I was going to get a sari. I think it was for like um, like a bull pot or like a bridal shower or something like that. Um, and so obviously when you're buying a sari, like it's not difficult. One size basically fits all and all you have to do is get the blouse made, right? So the store was an Indian store and I won't name it, um, but there was a Bengali auntie working there. So um, as we're shopping, she goes, oh, apnar jamai to ki lombar ki shundor. 
Apni to ek chumota se taina. And I was like, excuse me. Like, I was like, what? Did that just happen? And in front of everyone, too. So, anyway, she's like, I'm like, that's fine. I just want, like, a shari or something. She's like, Achha, dekhi. Ki ami babo dekhi, ami dekhi. So, she goes to the back, and she starts, like, pulling out all these sharis. And then I was like, I want to wrap one around me to see what it looks like. Because I kind of want to get a feel. And she goes, Oh, hey, tumi to ektu chora so. And I was like, sorry, my bangla is really bad. And I was like, did this just happen? So I, anyway, I started crying in the store because at the time I think I had like no um, confidence or I didn't have, yeah, I think I had confidence, but I was just like kind of shocked at what happened. And I was kind of also embarrassed being around um, Irshad because at the time that's when my body started kind of changing and it went from being pretty thin to becoming a bigger girl. And so I was kind of in that transition of just feeling awkward. And um, anyway, so she was at the end of it, I was just like, Auntie, like if you're selling to a bride, you're going to have brides walk out by reciprocating this type of behavior. So mom was like, Anisa, but seriously, homegirl deserved it. Like, you don't go up and diss brides and tell them in front of their face that their chora and the shari is not going to fit them. Like, what? What fucking shari? Even if I was like 50 pounds overweight this way, the shari would still effing fit, homegirl. But anyway, that's besides the point. Moving on to shipping. This is a question that a lot of my friends um, have asked me in the past few weeks. Um, but shipping was honestly really good. I think that for most of my outfits, except the one for my brother's wedding, it took about two to three weeks. Um, two weeks, especially when they were trying to do their rush orders for Eve. So I know that I got it on time. Um, but in terms of the customized order for my brother's wedding, I guess they were all customized, but this one was a little bit more detailed and extravagant. So that this one took like from the month that I messaged them which was January and February March I got it in March so January February March it took about three months and this includes discussing and talking and sharing ideas excuse me and sharing sketches um so it wasn't just like me placing the order and waiting three months to get it this was a lot of conversation in the middle and then finally getting the product um at the end of March so it wasn't too bad considering like what I was ordering um most items I would say take about two two weeks to three weeks shipping is free um, at least it's been for me every single time that I've ordered because they've always had like a sale or something like if you spend over a hundred dollars the shipping is free um, so no problems with shipping always arrived on time always arrived at my house I've never had to pick it up from a postal office um, so yeah overall really really good so I've ranted a lot about Lashkara being a positive website and a really good website to order from and, and by no means at all am I saying that they are bad. Um, but of course every single website has some things that they need to improve on um, and not just website, any sort of business I think has things that they need to improve on. So if I had to list a couple things that I would love for Lashkara to do so that they could improve, they would be the following. So to start, I wish you could order websites from the regular side of the website and then make them into your own size I understand that they probably come from other vendors and that's why you can't do that but it would be nice to have that option to say okay you know I like I don't know order number two three four five six um, is it possible to have this in a customized order so I can have it in my size and um, because they do have a lot of beautiful beautiful lengas and sharis and shawler kameezes but unfortunately you can only order from the exclusive line if you are plus size or looking for a customized fit second thing is um, petticoats for the saris so I have very wide hips um, and so the petticoats like I mean actually I have petticoats from random stores here in Toronto um, and I don't have any problems with it but when you're ordering from the Lashkar website they only go to a certain size um, so I've ordered that size before um, and you actually have to pay an additional $20 for that which isn't really a big deal because the shari itself was beautiful and it came with a blouse as a part of the final price I didn't have to pay extra um, or no actually I did I think I had to pay a stitching price which was like $14.95 or something 
something like that. Um, so it wasn't a big deal to me, but I think um, I kind of wish that their petticoat sizes ranged to be a little bit bigger. Um, and I think that uh, if they had more, like if you didn't have to pay extra for the petticoat, that would be nice. But I understand it is a business at the end of the day. One thing that uh, might contradict what I was saying before um, is there was a time that I ordered a few items, four to be exact, and two of them, um, I guess they didn't have in stock anymore. They didn't have the floral material for the dupatta anymore, um, but they had emailed me after I had already placed the order. So I was super excited about those two outfits especially, and I couldn't get them made, um, so that was kind of irritating, but they were very, very quick to let me know, hey, we don't have them in stock. These are some other options that are very similar, or if you have a customized picture, we can definitely make something in your size. So um, I just wish that they let me know like ahead of time like when I was ordering on the website but I understand that the turnaround time could have been really quick from the time that I actually made the order to the time that they were processing the order it could have been they could have been like out of the material completely so that is understandable talk about the positives well I feel like this whole um video was basically a positive because even with the negatives they are positives there are things that they can improve on to make themselves even better and to say that I only had three points that's pretty good um but really great website great selection um and i love that there's no backlash about ordering a customized piece in your size and not having to deal with that awkwardness um that you would have to maybe deal with in a store about being a bigger girl in a south asian community and ordering a lenga a shower kameez or a shari super trendy website in the sense that there are some pieces that are old on their website for sure they have to sell what they have to sell and they have to get their stuff out of stock um but super trendy in the sense that right now obviously i think the theme um or the trend is florals in um very pastel light colors and i think that that's exactly what they sell um and so super trendy on point um with that sort of stuff which makes it super easy to shop with the prices are extremely affordable. I mean, compared to what you're paying for in Toronto, this is really, really good. In Toronto, I could go to Gerard Street and buy something similar for like $550 plus. And even then, it wouldn't be in my size, so I'd have to pay for the customized shipping and everything on top of that. So Lashkar is really good with the prices, and in I hope that they never raise their prices too high, because this is a big reason why I keep coming back to this website. Um, it's the ability to buy more with my budget um, and on top of that in my size they're also really really great at replication so as I mentioned for my brother's wedding I had picked out an outfit that dress your face had done for um, a recent bride in the past year I believe her name is Roshni I forget her last name but um, really good at replicating exactly what I wanted I think the bottom was exact like absolutely no complaints the top because my chest is big I had imagined something different um, but it was still very very similar and I was super happy with the final result um, make sure to check check out their Instagram which is labeled down below um, also their website is I'm assuming it's www.lashkara.com, but I will post it here regardless. Um, yeah, make sure you explore their website. See what's there. See what's there for you. And then, of course, if you like anything that you see, make sure you grab it because they go by really, really fast. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you guys had fun on this little journey with me. Um, it was my first, like, filming video without doing a vlog, so I was a little bit nervous because I feel like I haven't, like, sat in front of a camera and talked about something specific. So, um, so if you guys liked what you saw, please make sure that you subscribe, that you hit the like button, and um, follow me on Instagram so that you can kind of keep up with my notifications and what I'm up to. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in, and I will see you guys soon. Bye!